Hey guys, today I'll talk about how to make this animation come to life with sound effects. We're gonna use whoosh sounds, data processing, and keyboard typing. When the screen opens up, we're gonna use a whoosh sound effect, which I'm gonna create from scratch. I recorded wind and generated white noise, and routed these sounds through a Doppler plugin effect. Good, and here it is with the animation. Great, now to the sound of the code that appears on the screen. I love using a virtual synthesizer for that. I simply choose a preset, play a high note, and duplicate. Great. Next is the blue glow that reveals the actual platform behind the code. For that, I'm going to use another synth, but this time I'm searching for string sounds. That's good. Now let's fade it a little EQ and compression, and voila. The next sound is keyboard typing. I could simply record myself typing on my keyboard, but that's boring. So let's speed up this sound drastically. Hear how it sounds. Much better. Now to the rolling keys. Let's add a fast whoosh sound and add a layer of typing sounds. Cool. And finally, the logo. I'm gonna use a combination of whooshes and UI sounds. Let's start with the whooshes. And for the other sounds, I'm using a high synth key sound, a UI sound, and data processing for the small titles. I added a few sounds to make it more interesting, like the sound of the shopping cart, a mouse click, and a few other whooshes here and there. And this is the final result. Alright guys, my name is Eitan Kraev. This animation was made by a company called Blackboard Studios for Tab9. If you like my content, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe. See you next time.